Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. So today I'm doing another review slash demo. In my last video I did do a review with lip swatches, but this time I'm doing a review and a demo of a skincare product, which is something different for my channel because I've I mainly, you know, makeup, 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 and I do talk about skin stuff here and there, but I've never done a video on it. I was recently recommended a makeup remover, oil cleanser theme of upper by a good friend of mine here on YouTube, so thank you, that's Seely. I thought I would do my own review slash demo for it because I know that um, everyone has different skin types and some people hate things while some people love things. I did personally love this product and she did too, but the product I'm going to be discussing today is the Garnier Clean Nourishing Cleansing Oil. What this claims to do is it dissolves impurities in makeup, replenishes the skin, and it's for dry skin. This formula is infused with nourishing jojoba, is that how you pronounce it? J-O-J-O-B-A. I'll put it right there, I don't know how to pronounce that. Um, and macadamia oil, it helps replenish skin's moisture balance. Results in one use, skin is deeply cleaned, hydrated, and skin feels velvety soft. After one week, 100% of women felt skin was smoother and softer. And this is for directions to make sure that hands and face are dry. Apply one to two pumps to fingertips and massage on the skin. Close eyes to remove, a, to remove eye makeup. Wet face to emul emulsify? Emulsify? I don't know. I'm not good at pronouncing words. Emulsify oil, then rinse thoroughly. It's dermatologist tested for safety and it's allergy tested and it's good for gentle skin. So that is everything that it claims to do and I do use it a little bit differently. I actually um, wash my face afterwards, mainly I think out of habit. I did use this last night without washing my face afterwards and my skin felt just as clean. So I'm sure it does clean your skin, but I'm really, really picky and I always feel like there's something there when there isn't. It's like almost a germaphobe thing. I don't know. So I wash my face afterwards as you will see in the demo clip that you will see next, but um, you don't need to do that. Uh, you can if you want, but you absolutely don't need to. I, like I said, I tried it without washing my face once and my skin felt soft, clean, it felt really well, it felt really good. I didn't need to put moisturizer on or anything. So, I'm going to roll to the clip for you guys so you guys can see, you know, how to use it, how I use it, um, and just, you know, watch it do its magic. So, I am forewarning you, it is not a glamorous clip. You will see me with eyeliner over to here because it is a little bit, it looks messy, but it's cleaning your face. So, yeah, I will just roll the clip and I will see you right afterwards. Alright guys, so I'm starting out with a full face of makeup and I'm going in with the Garnier Clean Nourishing Cleansing Oil. I am going to be showing you how this works today. So I start out with one to two pumps and I work in my hands and then you just work it all over your face. I'm really focusing on the eye area because that is where all my waterproof makeup is and this stuff just, I swear it dissolves it right off your skin. Now you will see eyeliner going all over my face, but that's because it is not a glamorous product to work with, but it is amazing. Now it looks like I'm being rough with my eyes, but I flex my eyes, if that makes sense. And so I'm actually being very gentle with them. Gotta make a crazy face, of course, because we look like a zombie. But anyway, so the product is working its magic. You can just see the eyeliner and the mascara coming off my face. And you just take a wet cloth and you wipe it away. And just look how clean my face is now. Isn't that crazy? I absolutely love this. Um, I just have to use a wet cloth and it takes all off. And you don't even need to wash your face after this. But I will be going in with moisturizer or, I mean, facial cleanser because I'm a little bit crazy like that. I overdo everything. So then I just wet my face one more time and go with my moisturizer, or cleanser, darn it. It's positively radiant from Aveeno. I use this every day. I don't normally use it at night, but I'm out of my night cleanser. Goodness. I'm out of my night cleanser, so I'm just using this right now. So anyways, I just work it on my face, making sure everything else is off my face. I really just like to be 100% sure and then I take a wet cloth again and I wipe it away and we'll just skip past this because you've seen me do it before 
So then you just want to pat your face dry. You never want to rub your face dry because that's just so bad for your skin because you're just tugging at it more than you need to. And going in with moisturizer, I'm using the Olay Active Hydrating Moisturizer. I've talked about this in my uh, must-have products. And I just love it. It's so gentle and it has barely any scent to it. It's good for every single skin type. And I just, I've been using it for years and I will probably always go back to this one. So, yeah, that is it for this demo. You can see how clean my face is. Okay, so as you saw how it worked, it did clean my face very well. It has, ever since I started using this product, it's taken my nighttime routine of removing my makeup. It's cut about, I'd say five or six minutes off of it. If I did it just how it says, so just use this to, um, to remove my makeup and cleanse my face and moisturize it, it can be done in about three minutes. I do like to wash my face afterwards just because I'm weird like that. So it does take me actually about five minutes to uh, do all my stuff, but five minutes to remove makeup, wash your face, clean, uh, make sure it's cleansed, get all that makeup off and moisturize. That's pretty darn good, I think. My overall thoughts of this product is I really, really, really love this. I did want to put it in my monthly favorites that I just put up, but I'd only been using it for like two or three days and I wanted to wait to do a review on it for you guys so that it didn't seem confusing or anything like that. But yes, I do love this product so very much. I don't even use makeup wipes anymore. Literally, I slap this on my face, get all my makeup off, uh, take a rag, wipe it off, and boom, I'm done. My face is good to go. My skin is just as nice. It actually feels really moisturized and soft all day long. And the beauty of this stuff, because I've talked about this lip issue that I have all the time, when I scrub over this area, my I still have the lip issue, but it's not like it was before. Like it's less and less and less to the point where I feel like I just have average dry lips here and there and I just apply chapstick and I'm good to go. I mean, you don't see any redness whatsoever and if I was to zoom in, you wouldn't even see bumps or anything from like covering it up with concealer. This is seriously amazing stuff. I absolutely love it. This was I think about $5.50. Uh, but it's totally, totally worth it. I usually wouldn't think of Garnier as like skincare stuff because I mainly think of them as hair stuff, but I absolutely love this. As that Celie mentioned, she did mention that it can be a little bit of a messy product, but she also did use it in the shower. So I thought because it's an oil, I was like, well, I'm going to be like extremely careful and maybe I can see if it's not as messy. But I wipe this down afterwards and like when I'm pumping it, like I dip it like this just so that nothing drips down and I don't know what it feels like oil soaks through the bottle but um yeah so you can feel the paper coming up or, but I mean it's a little messy but I can get over that with how good it is so I mean that's just you know a harmless kind of you know thing about it so it doesn't actually change the product itself for me. So that is my full review of the product. You saw my demo on it and you saw a little bit of my skincare. If you'd like to see a full skincare video about how I take care of my skin and all the, like, the little things I do here and there, then let me know. But other than that, I think I will stick to what I just showed you. So yeah, I really do hope you enjoyed this video and if it was helpful for you or you enjoyed it, give this video a big old thumbs up and comment down below. If you've tried this product and you have a little bit different opinion, let me know down below because I'd like to see what other people think about it. The only other person I heard talk about it was that Celie. She said she loved it and I love it. So don't forget to follow all my social media down below. Always have it linked and don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed this so you don't miss any more of my videos. And yeah. So I hope you enjoy this background. I got some beautiful flowers and an orchid for Mother's Day and I just wanted them to be in my video because I love them so much and I love plants and flowers and I'm surprised my thumbs aren't green right now. So anyways, yeah, I'm going to get going and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.